guys it is official the uk home office and the immigration office have made a decision that from the 11th of march 2024 more and more companies currently recruiting overseas worker will no longer be able to issue cos to foreign workers the tension is becoming really high and guys the market is becoming very competitive in today's video i'm going to tell you what you should do so that you can get yourself your dream job of coming into the uk to practice now guys trust me when there is a will there is a will so you have to be intentional about what you want we will be talking about that in today's video if you are interested stay tuned ryan little <laughs> Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. My name is Violet Okolacha. I'm a registered nurse. I live and I practice in the United Kingdom. And on this channel, literally, I share things like this. So do me a favor, like this video so you don't forget. Share this video and of course, don't forget to subscribe. Now guys, back to what we were talking about. It's been officially announced by the UK government and the immigration office that from the 11th of March 2024, more and more companies will no longer be able to issue cos to foreign workers trust me guys it's no longer a news but i'll tell you what to do before the end of this video so it's no longer a news but firstly you have to be intentional about what you want because when there is a will there is a way you just have to sit your heart down and strategize new strategies of what i want to land myself that dream that aspiration of coming to the united kingdom to follow my feed or to follow my discipline it has a nurse it has a care worker it has an accountant it has an it whichever is your discipline but you have to be intentional and make way to strategize how to do it and how to get it okay now guys i want to say this specifically if you are currently looking for a job you have to be intentional about what you want you know why it's only CQC regulated company that are now able to issue COS. So most companies who issued COS to people currently in the UK, some of them are not CQC regulated. So the truth is they will no longer be able to issue COS to new overseas worker. But the staff they already have, they will be able to renew their COS. That means when their visa expires for their current staff, they will be able to renew their COS and you know extend their stay but they cannot issue new COS to new foreign worker except they are CQC registered you understand except they are CQC regulated that is the news at hand now so be intentional about what you want the question now will be as well as how will I know if the company I'm applying to is CQC registered beautiful always check their website always check their website and it's always on their website but if you don't find it on their website go on go, go. CQC regulated company currently issuing COS and you know and that's where you can just apply to those companies directly that's why i said the market is more competitive because those companies now will not be able to issue new cos because they are not cqc regulated so the market is becoming competitive do you understand it's becoming increasingly difficult these days to get a job with cos but people are still getting like i said in my last video people are still getting but you must be intentional about what you want and be strategic about it now what should i do not violent how do i solve this problem i have that dream i'm intentional i'm strategic i'm ready to do what it takes now have a seat you are the exact person that needs this video beautiful now this is a clarion call if you have passed your ILTS exam and you have passed your cbt exam you already have what it takes to come and take your oski exam can i ask you what are you waiting for trust me the best time to get yourself on the self-sponsorship route 
It is now. I'm not joking. It is not tomorrow. It is now. You have to make air while the sun shines. All you need to do is to book your OSCE exam. OSCE exam costs 794 pounds. Book your OSCE exam. Get a visiting visa to come and take your OSCE exam here in the United Kingdom. There are five centers currently offering that exam. Yes. Yes, that's what you need to do. No wasting time. Nosvi, I don't have money. Trust me, guys. Even in the free time, nothing is free. If you are intentional about it, if you are strategic about it, if you have that will and that drive that want to come into the UK and practice with whichever your discipline is, then you have to be intentional. The way to be intentional is to do all it takes to achieve it. Positively, all it takes. Because when there is a will, trust me, there is a way. Now, a lot of people have asked me, Nosvi, if I come on the sales sponsorship proof, will I get the job? Trust me, sweetheart. Trust me, honey. You will definitely get the job. I tell you, there is a huge 80%, should I say 90? 90% chance of getting a job when you have your pain. You become like me. Obviously, I have my pain. I'm practicing as a nurse here and you have your pain. Lots and lots of companies that are currently recruiting nurses, currently recruiting nurses currently will tell you nurses with pain. Visa sponsorship available, nurses with pain, nurses with pain. And if you don't have that pain in this competitive market, oh my God, COS is declining these days. Yes, for international, most NHS trust, most companies are no longer recruiting overseas workers because they are no longer recruiting overseas workers because they know that they're going to be spending a lot. But if you have your pain, lots of job vacancies these days are looking for nurses with pain. So the market is really competitive and you want to make sure you meet the requirements. I mean. So that's why I'm suggesting self sponsorship route for you. Nosvi, is it going to cost me money? It's going to cost you money. But I've said it before when there's a will, there's a way. And even in a free town, nothing is free. So you have to work, strategize with your family, and see how you can achieve your dream of coming into the United Kingdom and making sure you follow your field of practice all right so why is there no more cos why is cos declining of course it should because we saw how lots and lots of companies were bringing overseas workers and not having enough hours to give to them we saw lots of people stranded in the uk and having to depend on food bank for their survivor and because of all these that's why the home office is making straighter and straighter rules for foreign workers but you know what it's worth it eventually. I have to be honest with you. It's worth it. Okay? So, that's it. So, make sure you're intentional about what you want. And I'll tell you, was it two days ago, somebody called me and said to me, Nos Violet, I've gotten a job. She did call me because she booked a class. So, if you're not sure of the sex sponsorship route, you have lots and lots of questions in your mind, then you have to book a class. You have to book a class and I can guide you, I can mentor you, and I can talk to you about it. But you have to book a class if you don't understand anything. And like I was saying, three days ago, I, don't, oh, I almost mentioned her name, she did call me and I've already talked to her about the sex sponsorship route and she's done lots of jobs application. And she's even paid for her own skills exam she's booked a visa but visa is no year out because she did it a week ago and guess what guys three days ago she called me or two days ago so that i don't tell lies and it was fantastic news we've canceled our own ski exam but the thing is we visiting visa we can't cancel anymore she's gotten a job with sponsorship they are willing they told her cancel your OSCE exam, we're going to pay for your OSCE exam for you. They've even issued a COS ASAP. And that's why I've said to call lots of people saying, uh, they've not issued my COS, they've not issued my ECOS. It doesn't take time to issue COS, although she got a job with the NHS. You get it? So, while you are waiting on God to answer you, you just have to get yourself on the self sponsorship route. All right, guys, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to share, don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in another of my juicy videos. Until I see you again, have a blissful, beautiful week. Bye, guys.